in the case of who shot me, um, that just was a really eye-opening experience for me because I had seen things occurring, I had heard of things occurring that were not directly me. They were not physically me, you know. So once I had that kind of violation of my space, then it kind of, it opened my eyes to all of these different ways of viewing things. So I understand that people have to be proactive about getting answers, about asking questions, about agitating as much as possible because if the people are not concerned, then none of those governing bodies are going to be concerned. So the people have to really show a true concern and a true body of knowledge of what's going on in order to get some of these problems solved. And that's what I'm seeking to do immediately is to educate myself and the people around me as much as possible so that we know how to move forward um, with further steps toward getting the answers that we're looking for. Specifically in terms of my case, you know, me being shot in the head, out in Ferguson, um, and also in terms of Michael Brown Jr. Why was he shot six times, you know, and shot at 10 times? Things like that shouldn't happen on a day-to-day -day basis. So long-term, I would be looking to put these things that we're doing immediately into people's minds so that they get into the habit of being knowledgeable, in the habit of asking questions, and in the habit of informing other people through uh, whatever craft they choose. My particular medium is through literary art. So uh, what I think is going to be really, really critical for this to be long term is artist involvement. Artists will continually remind people of this truth, uh, regardless of if they want to see it or hear it. People are, you know, they gravitate toward the artist, wherever, you know, that artist may practice their craft, whether it is in music, sculpture, paint, video, film, um, dance. All of these things can be incorporated into a worldwide knowledge base. And I think that long term, that's going to be the most successful way to really get at this thing that we're facing.